Buffalo Falls signs a non-guaranteed deal here with the Cleveland Cavaliers of a 7-5. Big man here who spent the first two seasons of his NBA career with the Boston Celtics. And now he goes to Cleveland. And he's a guy that really hasn't appeared in many NBA games so far in the first two seasons of his career. Last season with the Celtics, 2.6 points a game. Three rebounds, 0.2 assists, 0.1 steal, 72% from the field. So Taco Fall, obviously he's a big body. And already in his third year in the NBA, he's not getting a guaranteed roster spot with this Cleveland Cavalier team because he don't really bring much to the table besides height. He's not a quick guy. He's not a guy that can stretch the floor either or hit three-pointers. And right here, we'll see if he latches on and makes this Cavalier team, which I think he probably will this season as an end-of-the-bench type of ball player once again for this roster. So Taco Fall, it's a good story. He made the NBA, especially a guy that height nowadays. There's not much use if you don't have one great skill or could stretch the floor at least here. But Taco Fall, as far as fantasy basketball goes, obviously he's not going to have no fantasy appeal unless tons of guys get injured. And he's the third or fourth man next up in this Cleveland Cavalier team if he makes the team. But I think he'll make the team as a back-end guy. And we'll see if he could develop and have any impact heading in the upcoming 2021-2022 NBA season.